Discectomy is a surgical procedure that attempts to relieve pressure on spinal nerves and the cauda equina. It's most commonly performed to relieve the pain caused by a ruptured or herniated disc pressing on nerve roots. There are 24 vertebrae in the spine. These vertebrae are connected by several joints. The main joint is a flexible cushion between two vertebrae called an intervertebral disc. The intervertebral disc is comprised of a soft gelatinous center surrounded by a tough outer wall. When the gelatinous core pushes out through a tear in the fibrous wall, the disc herniates, adding pressure to the surrounding spinal nerves, which causes pain. When undergoing a discectomy procedure, you will be positioned on your stomach on the surgical table, surrounded by the appropriate surgical draping. An x-ray of your spine will be taken to show the appropriate disc space. Your surgeon will make a small incision along your middle back. A retractor may be used to provide your surgeon direct access to the affected area. Nerve monitoring can be used to monitor disturbances to nerves during spinal procedures. Next, your surgeon will remove the protruding or herniated portions of the disc. The healthy portion of the disc is left intact. Pressure on the nerve root is relieved and pain is alleviated.